This training session is designed to teach you the basics of finding secondary sources using Westlaw UK. This module will cover searching across journals, current awareness and books, accessing full text documents and abstracts, using different methods of searching. At the end of the basic training modules, you can take the test to gain your certification. Now you know how to find primary law, you may want to use secondary sources on Westlaw UK to further your reading. You've already learned how to search for documents using the home page. Let's jump straight into finding journals first. Westlaw UK contains thousands of articles in full text. It also provides abstracts of journal articles with links to relevant case law and legislation. Here is the basic search template. You can search by article title, author and journal title using this template. Click more options to view more search fields. This allows you to search for articles discussing specific legal definitions, cases or organisations. If you use the subject or keyword box, Westlaw UK will suggest what you may be looking for. Let's select police bail from the suggestions. You could also enter additional search terms into the other fields to narrow your search. Westlaw UK will retrieve your search results. You can see from the results that some articles only link to the abstract, others may have links to both the abstract and full text article. You can edit your search using this button. Use the filters on the left hand side to narrow down your results. You can also filter to only show the journal articles we have in full text. We'll now click on the link from the journal article title. You will be taken into the abstract. The abstract is useful because it provides a short synopsis of the article as well as easy access to any primary law referenced. If available, you can switch between the abstract and full text documents. References to cases and legislation are linked for easy access. Use the table of contents to jump into any section of the article. All footnotes are linked within the text. When you click on a footnote, a pop-up appears with further information. Click the X to close the footnote. If you highlight a section of text, the annotation options appear. These allow you to add a note, highlight and also copy the text with or without reference. Let's now browse for a journal. From the top menu, hover over journals and click into publications. You will be able to browse through journals alphabetically. As you scroll down, you will be able to see which journal series are available in full text or abstract. If you click on this icon, you will see further information about the series, including its coverage and publisher details. Use this box to search for a specific publication. Alternatively, use this filter to just see full text journals only. Under the title of the journal, you'll see its citation. By browsing, 
you can see all the most recent articles for the journal. You can also use these filters to narrow down to a specific publication year or issue. Current Awareness is a very useful legal update service. It's updated every five minutes during the week, so you can see the very latest developments in case law, legislation, news, and government publications. On the right hand side, you can see the key dates calendar, so you can browse for developments by date. You can search across all current awareness and use the options to narrow your results to a specific document type or topic. Westlaw UK will retrieve the very latest legal developments that match your search. You can browse into the legal update by document type or topic. When you browse by topic, you will see the most recent developments sorted by document type. Click View All to see more results. Current Awareness will give you an abstract of the document, including links to any primary law and external websites. Use the submenu to also browse into the most recently added or highlights. You may also have access to books and practitioner texts on Westlaw UK. To access, click on the menu at the very top left of the page to switch into books. Here you'll find a list of books available to you on Westlaw UK. Using practitioner texts can be a useful way of ensuring you understand the legal concept or process by seeing its application. By default, you should only see the books you have access to. Use filters to display books by topic, jurisdiction, publisher, your favourites, or whether you have access to them. When you save books as a favourite, they will appear at the very top of the page for quick and easy access. You will be able to search and browse through the contents of the book. You can also use the index to find material on a specific principle of law or concept. You can browse the index alphabetically. You can also use the index to find material on a specific principle of law or concept. You will be able to read and quickly link into referenced materials and make annotations. Click on the heading to jump back to the table of contents. Use the table of contents to browse into the book. This symbol indicates content that has been recently updated by a supplement. Click the book icon on the right hand side to switch on reading mode. Reading mode allows you to seamlessly browse through the book from one page to another. As you reach the end of the page, the next page will automatically load so you can continue reading. You can also scroll up so the previous page will load too. The table of contents will always indicate where you are in the book. Thank you for completing this training covering using secondary sources on Westlaw UK. If you ever need assistance in using Westlaw UK, you can contact our support team on 0345 600 9355. You can also get in touch with your Thomson Reuters legal student representative at your university.